Hello and welcome to PLZ Soccer. This is your Scottish Evening News Bulletin on Monday. St Mirren manager Jim Goodwin has said he wants to make the Buddies a permanent fixture in the top six before moving on to a bigger club after he signed a three-year contract extension this morning. Goodwin's side are seventh with the split in the horizon but they do have two games in hand on sixth place Dundee United, starting with Hamilton on Wednesday. And that's why I've committed to the club for the next three seasons because the club matches my ambitions. Um, you know, I'm not going to sit here and patronise anybody and, and say that I'm going to be at St Mirren for the next 15 years of my life, you know, it, hopefully everything goes according to plan. I make St Mirren the, the top six team that I want to make them. We go and win a little bit of silver, silverware over the next two or three years. And if I do that, then I might be given the opportunity to go and manage at a, a bigger club. Scotland's First Minister Nicola Sturgeon has urged football to make sure their house is in order as Rangers launched an internal investigation after a weekend party was broken up by police. The jurors said they were aware of an alleged incident. They're not making any further comments as they investigate. It remains unclear how many players were involved and if they were charged at all. Now, the jurors will aim to resolve this quickly as they have the return of the Europa League against Antwerp on Thursday. We'll go there and give it everything we've got and try and set it up for the second leg and then um, we'll switch our attention back to the league. But the players should be really excited now and really embrace what's in front of them and just go and be the best version of themselves as they do. They've got a wonderful opportunity to turn this season into a success. And Fiona McIntyre has been appointed as the SFA's Head of Women's and Girls Football, saying she is looking forward to the terrific opportunity to build upon the fantastic work and foundations already in place. McIntyre had been Chief Executive Officer with Scottish Women's Football since 2017. Thanks for watching and don't forget you can like, share and subscribe to our Facebook, YouTube and Twitter channels where you can also catch up with the football show with Peter and Ruffy. They will have discussed all of today's stories with the panel and exclusive guests.